ever wondered what inspired Billie Eilish's captivating song, What Was I Made For? Dive into the depths of her music universe as we unveil the emotional journey behind this haunting hit. Join us on Discernitively for an exploration that connects the essence of Barbie with Billie's soulful storytelling. Today, we are looking into the Barbie soundtrack that was a showstopper at the 2023 Leeds Festival, The Enigma of Billie Eilish. Imagine clicking on the mesmerizing, what was I made for from the Barbie soundtrack? Whether you're a diehard fan or a curious newcomer, prepare for a transformative experience. Billie Eilish, known for her hit Bad Guy, is a genre-defying artist, now channeling her haunting vocals and unique artistry to capture the essence of the complex Barbie character. At the dynamic Leeds Festival, where genres collide and post-GCSE students celebrate, Billie Eilish shines. Her groundbreaking performance captivates festival goers old and new, making her the highlight of the event. Did you know that the Leeds Festival 2023 introduced sign language interpreters for hard of hearing fans? What was I made for? Picture Billy and her brother Phineas sitting down to watch Greta Gerwig's Barbie movie, not even sure they'll contribute to the soundtrack. But inspiration strikes like lightning. By the next evening, they've penned What Was I Made For? A song that captures Barbie's existential journey. We were purely only thinking about Barbie, she notes during an interview with Zane Lowe. Little does Billy know, she's also writing her own emotional autobiography. In the car, Billie Eilish listens to her new song and has an epiphany. It was truly the trippiest thing, the artist tells Lowe. I was like, oh, I absolutely was writing about myself, but I was thinking about myself from a third person. The song filled with lyrics about losing a happier past self and questioning the future isn't just a tale. It's her own life story, captured in melody. I was an ideal, looked so alive. Turns out I'm not real just something you paid for. She sings, encapsulating both Barbie's existential crisis and her own journey through young stardom. The kicker? She didn't even intend for it to be autobiographical. It just happened. The song becomes not just a hit, but a mirror reflecting Eilish's own complex emotions and experiences. Did you know? Billie Eilish credits writing for the Barbie soundtrack for pulling her out of a creative block. Fast forward to the music video, which Billy directs herself. She brilliantly fuses her lifelong Barbie obsession with her own evolving identity. As she sorts through miniature versions of her iconic outfits, it's like she's sifting through layers of her past and present, asking, who am I now? The song and video become a mirror, reflecting both Barbie's and Billy's quests for meaning. It's a eureka moment for the artist, who later realizes the song is not just about Barbie, but also a raw look into her own soul. Are you a fan of Billie Eilish's hit song, Bad Guy? Guess what? You can now own a piece of her iconic Bad Guy vibe with the Billie Eilish Bad Guy fashion doll in brilliant yellow. As we explore the essence of her hit, why not rock her style too? Get yours now from the Amazon link in the description. Stay tuned to groove to both her music and fashion. The headliner of the festival. Four years ago, Billie Eilish was just another name halfway down the festival bill, performing to a modest crowd. Fast forward to today, and she's making history as the youngest ever headliner at the festival. It's a meteoric rise that leaves even her in disbelief. Can you believe what my life turned into? She muses to the crowd. At just 21, she's navigating the complexities and pressures of superstardom, but the night of the festival, she's the epitome of joyful ease. With her brother and producer Phineas by her side, Eilish electrifies the crowd as she launches into Bury a Friend, setting the tone for a night of musical alchemy. She navigates the audience through a curated set list of her hits, featuring standouts from her latest album, Happier Than Ever. Then comes the show-stopping moment, her soul-stirring rendition of What Was I Made For from the Barbie soundtrack. Performing it live, she elevates the festival atmosphere, turning it into a sanctuary of raw emotion and intricate artistry. It's a watershed moment, not just for Eilish, but for the captivated fans who find a piece of themselves in her lyrics as they sing along, united in a collective catharsis. Did you know the festival included an impromptu meditation session led by Billie Eilish, focusing on mental health and mindfulness? And 
that's it for today's video. What was your favorite performance at Leeds Festival 2023? Let us know in the comments below. Discernitively, we'll be waiting for your feedback. Watch our video about the Snow White remake controversies or the one below about the first Republican debate.